You are looking at the sons of respectively Brickhouse Baker and Big Daddy Bravo, known as the Big Kahuna of Top Ropes early days. This is gonna be a hard hitting match. You've got two very big men in the ring right now, and oh, he's starting off big with a big right hand right to the face of David Baker. This is not going to be pretty. This is not going to be for the faint of heart by any stretch of the imagination. This is going to be brutal. Bobby Rossi, this is never going to be pretty. This is going to be something you want to see. This is going to be a car wreck. These two are going to be in there, and they're going to beat the absolute crap out of each other, just like we're seeing right now. Do not expect to see any holds. Do not expect to see any type of wrestling. This is going to be a fight. You've seen a bunch of counters, reversals, and exchanges! Oh and the Brick sends LDB outside of the ring with a thunderous lariat taking off his head practically. If little daddy Bravo is smart, he takes some time out there. He's got a 10 count. He better use nine of those 10 seconds because he needs to regroup after that big one. He's not getting 10 seconds. The Brick is on the chase. Oh. And he's throwing those chiyos! I can't even describe what I'm seeing right now. These are two mammoths, two extremely big men just exchanging shots for shot right now. This is violence personified. We expected nothing less from these two big galoots. They are not finesse wrestlers. These are power guys. I'll tell you, the rack on little daddy, daddy Bravo right now is bright red. Oh my goodness, he looks like an Irishman with chest hair. Swinging sidewalk slam to the apron sends Baker off of his feet. But more importantly, that got Baker right back into the ring for a pin. That was very smart wrestling. I don't know if Little Daddy Bravo did that on purpose, but he got him right where he needed him. That was good wrestling. Little Daddy Bravo is another one who's been plying his craft, and he's looking to make his way further up the ranks in the professional oh. wrestling scene, and you do so by taking on tougher competition. That is just what's going on tonight, my friend. And very few are tougher than anybody with the last name Baker. Brickhouse, David, his brother, these are all incredibly, incredibly tough men. Little Daddy Bravo, I don't know if he wanted the challenge, but he's in there with a tough man. He's getting one, and I'll tell you right now, he's putting up a fantastic fight. Oh! David Baker with a drop salt, sending LDB to the mat. That was extremely unexpected from David. Oh springboard! Springboard! Leg drop! I don't know where this is coming from, Bobby Rossi. Never in my life have I seen, have I seen any, any of the Bakers do anything like that. That is absolutely amazing. I said corrected. Oh. I said this match was going to be a fight, and David Baker is taking to the air. What am I witnessing? It went from a street fight to Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon really quick. But right, but right away, he brought it right back down to the mat. He dropped a big knee right in the back of little Daddy Bravo's head. Dan Terry, I am amazed. Big swing and a miss. Oh, oh, Spine Buster. Oh, I thought he had him that time. Spine Buster, that's a move you see a lot, but when it's done by a man the size of Little Daddy Bravo, he calls himself Little Daddy Bravo, that's a big, big hunk of beef right there. And he put David Baker right down. What an incredible back and forth between these two. LDB would service himself well to keep David Baker on the mat and potentially knocked out. Because if he gets his second win, boy, is he in for it. If David Baker was smart, he'd just stay down. He got rocked with those shots on the mat. And it's, I can tell you, those hurt a lot. But David Baker, those are come from a big, big man who is now going to the top rope. And David Baker's, oh! Little Daddy Bravo outside of his element. David Baker quick to capitalize. Oh my goodness, I'm feeling those chops all the way on the announce table. Bobby Rossi, have you ever felt the chop like that? No, and I don't ever intend to. Well, we'll see what happens, but later on, we'll, maybe we'll give you one or two. <laughs> David Baker's having a tough time getting those ropes. Those are two, two very large men up there right now. Those ropes are round. Oh! Those are round type, and little Daddy Bravo, can he get up there? David Baker! Overhead! Oh! 
suplex from the second row! Forget Little Daddy Bravo, how the hell is the ring still together? That is at least 700 pounds of man. Big, big, sweaty man that just came down onto that sleek black ring. My goodness. Your words create imagery like no one other, Dan Terry. I am a true poet, Bobby Rossi, but these men, these men are poets of pain, and they are signing names to that poem. Oh, chopping the right tit. Oh, and he chopped his tit. Oh, hope the baby's not hungry tonight, because those things are going to be tender. David Baker taking the areolas off of Little Daddy Bravo's chest, and these two are now having a dick-waving contest. Oh, I don't care about dicks, but those are some big hands. So who knows, maybe those dicks are a good size. If we're talking dicks, though, I can't wait to see dick later, later, later on. Or any dick, but let's get back to this man. I mean, I, you seem like more of a dick justice kind of guy, but nonetheless, their little daddy Bravo now, it looks as if David Baker's gonna pick him up for that pop-up power now! Yes, and that ring, did you see the ring just spring down and come back up? That was another sight of hunk of beef a man. And he's put him down again. This ring can't take it. Oh, thank God for the ring. Baker off the ropes. Mariano! Chest is mighty red. Oh. David Baker extending a hand. Very a nice. Show of sportsmanship. Very nice show of sportsmanship. These two beat the absolute crap out of one another, and now they are showing respect in the ring. Hashtag anytime, any place. Hashtag let's do it again sometime. I would love to see these two monsters go at it again. I don't know if their chest can take it, but we'll see what happens. The hits will continue, and RWA's fuck this weather. Jesus Christ, Bobby Rossi. No leg slaps here. That was all meat on meat action. <laughs> 